Uh, I have uh, a leg infection and a gaping wound is weeping. Uh, you can see the uh, leg is infected. It's red. You see how it's red? It's infected. It's got sores all over it. And it's got this wound where the skin just sloughed off. And that's what developed in this place. Uh, Upper Chesapeake. University of Maryland. Upper Chesapeake in Bel Air. Uh, told me that that is a rash. A dermatitis. And refused to treat me. As they were gang stalking me and harassing me, and their guards were giving me a hard time. And uh, I've got this thing. This thing here, which has been there for weeks. It's some kind of a, probably a malignant mold of some sort. Uh, they called that a pit bull. He said it was a pit bull. And the, the gaping infected wound it in my leg and the infect, infection all over my leg is just a rash. So, uh, yeah. <clears throat> and I've already sent, I've already sent my request for uh, political asylum to the uh, address that the consular at the embassy of the government I'm going to for help, I already sent that out. And I'm waiting for a reply. And I've also been told to go down, if I wanted to come down to the embassy, that I can write out a, you know, write out my request, in, you know, physical paper form, and uh, put an envelope, seal it up. And come down there and pass it to the uh, guard at the gate. And they will take it and forward it to the proper people. The, the, whatever. Um, <clears throat> and I also have the mailing address for the president of that government. And I do plan to send a registered uh, signature upon receipt. Uh, letter uh, seeking political asylum to the president of that government. So uh, these uh, these people, these government motherfuckers, they have uh, created a situation where I cannot. I I'm being denied medical treatment for potentially life-threatening conditions, and that's not acceptable.